I scared myself recently. Seriously, I scared myself. Someone says to me, Leggy, Leggy, how many fragrances have you got in your collection? And I thought, you know what, for a long time I've kind of, oh, I don't want to know, I don't want to count them. So I did a big clear out, a big sort out. I got some new boxes to put them all in in my wardrobe and that sort of thing. And I thought, you know what, I do need to count them. I started counting my decants, my miniatures, my samples, and I got up to 189. And at that point, I couldn't bring myself to count all the real bottles I've got. You know what? It is scary how many I've got. But you know what? The crazy thing is, I do, I use them all, I spray them all, I lend them to people, I lend them to friends, family, neighbours and whatever. I get feedback, I love these bottles, I'll share them with you. And this is why I'm on this channel. This is the reason. I want to share these fragrances and I seriously want to inspire you you my friend to wear a good fragrance every single day this one this one is going to blow a hole in your pants seriously in fact several holes in your pants my favorite fragrance from the house of perfume de Marley is pegasus all right the core is lavender what a fantastic place to start lavender and then you've got a, a lorry load of sort of almond you've got a lorry load of vanilla and seriously that is pretty much this fragrance the only other thing in this is a sort of a metallic -y note do not ask me if it's iron, whether it's steel, whether it's aluminium. I do not know. And I don't know how they created, but it has a weird but wonderful metallic -y note just sort of hovering around all the other notes in there. Okay, I'm going to put it forward. Perfume de Marley. It's ridiculously sweet, but it is very, very much a perfect men's scent. Okay, it's very much the perfect scent as well. Okay, it's very versatile, all year round perfect. It is super, super sexy. Women love, love this fragrance coming off a guy. Seriously, the results you will get from Parfum de Marley's Pegasus is amazing. But the problem is, just like the cap weighs half a ton, if you drop it on your foot, you're not walking for a few weeks. This is a very heavy, price tag for the 120 mil i think it's 120 mil to wave size 120 mil the original perfume de Marley's is around about 210 pounds okay it's out of the price range for most people but the smell is stunning and yes there is options let's talk about the options okay Armaf du Craze. Now this is a very old bottle of Craze. I'm told it's been reformulated. This cost me around about, I think it's about 24, 25 pound for the 100 mil. And this, okay, the cap's rubbish because the cap, okay, it holds onto the spray and you have to try and get the sprayer out of here. Not bothered about that. But when you can get it to spray, this is pretty much a 90 sort of seven percent perfume de Marley's Pegasus okay I'm told it's been reformulated I'm told that the newer bottles of Craze very much diluted and the performance is pretty sad okay let's just go back to the performance on the perfume de Marley the perfume de Marley is pretty much an all day scent the first two hours is very loud and then it dips down to a reasonable scent bubble and for the rest of the day it will gently trail off you as the wearer when you are wearing the original perfume de Marley you smell it all day long on clothes it's there for a couple of days skin most likely the next morning it will still be there unless you're showered which you should do. <clears throat> the other option is the uh, Pandora Scents, okay? It's called Pegasium. All right, this, you know what? I think this cost me about 25 or 30 pound, 100 ml of the perfume. This is pretty much 
a bang on copy of the scent. The performance is okay. The performance is very similar to the Armuff Craze as in the original Armuff Craze, not the new reformulated if it is. Okay. Latifa. Let's talk about Latifa. Let's talk about their branch, which is called Mason Alhambra. I've got several of these fragrances and each one is blowing me apart, seriously. And this one, above perhaps all of them so far, has blown me totally apart. Because 18 British pounds, 18 pound, what? 18 British pounds buys you Perseus by Maison Alhambra, which, going back a little bit further, is part of the mighty Latifa Empire. Let me spray this one and tell you what you're gonna get. Okay, so with a lot of the Maison Alhambras, it's, uh, they start off with a sort of a alcoholic, sort of chemical, sort of 10 minutes of ugh. This one, Perseus, is straight into the fragrance. There is nothing to go through to get there. All right, let me put a crazy, crazy percentage on it. Perseus is 98.5% Puffium de Mali's Pegasus. The lavender, the almond, the vanilla. And ridiculously, they have also captured perfectly, perfectly that metallic -y sort of note. Okay, now you're going to go leggy, the metallic you note, know, does it work? Yes, it weirdly does in this fragrance. It absolutely does. Now, the performance of this £18 fragrance is unbelievable. It is very ridiculously similar to the real thing. Okay? The Perseus by Mason Alhambra for the first two hours is great. It's a good projection. Then it dips down and for, the, for another sort of five hours, this stuff radiates off you. Just gently radiates. You're in, you're, you're in a scent bubble for the next sort of four or five hours comfortably and this stuff you get it on clothes it's there for a few days get it on skin well get it on skin you're gonna spray it on skin come on leggy on the skin it is there all day long this stuff needs to be bought if you like <laughs> pegasus by perfume de Marley. in fact i'm going to be perfectly honest with you this is from the heart there is absolutely no need to spend the big money on the Puffium de Mali because this one is an equivalent. Now, there are clones and there are clones. And this is a clone. This, seriously, that it is unmistakably Pegasus. You cannot go, hmm, wonder what that is. Right. Instantly, when you smell it, you're going to go Pegasus. It is 100% the same smell, and the performance is so, so similar. All right, I need to tell you a story about one of the guys I've worked with. I work with some fantastic people. One of the guys in sales, he hasn't been there that long. I think he's been with us about two or three months. And he came in, and I was talking to him, and he saw all the bottles of fragrance by my computer. His name's Reese. And he says, oh, what, what are those there for? Like, I said, oh, you know, I do reviews and I collect fragrances, blah, blah, blah. And one of them happened to be this one. Just happened to be on that day. And I sprayed it and he went, cool, Leggy. He says, I bet that's expensive. And I said, it's £18, mate. He says, can you get me one? 
Anyway, in the meantime, I lent him this buckle and he was dating this girl. And he came to me the next day. He says, Licky, she doesn't stop talking about the fragrance all the time. She says, she says, I smell great. She's on and on about this fragrance. In fact, Reese came to me recently because he's. But I ordered him a bottle. It came through. And he's got his own bottle now. He come to me, says so Leggy, the other day. He says, eighteen pound. He says, that eighteen pound seriously has changed my life. Okay, it is absolutely a bargain. So I'm going to say to you, get yourself on eBay. I think most people are selling it for about 18, 19 pounds. It's 18, 99 on some of them. All right, because I, I was buying a couple of bottles, I managed to get a deal, I got it down to 18 pounds. Even, you know what, even if it's gone up a little bit and you've got to spend maybe 20 pounds, seriously, this is so well worth it. It works well, it smells amazing, and it realistically, it eliminates you the need to spend the big money on the puffy and tamale. In fact, of all the clones of perfume de Mali, that, seriously my friends, that is the one to buy. They have got it absolutely bang on. I'm going to love you and leave you now. But before I go, I'm going to say I really appreciate you coming to this channel. I appreciate your viewing. I appreciate the fact that you're just about to do a cheeky thumbs up. Thank you. And I appreciate the fact that you're considering coming back next time because that would be awesome to see you again. In the meantime though, please stay safe and more importantly than anything else, spray a good fragrance every day. And if you are just about to leave your house on the morning and you haven't sprayed a fragrance, I want to be the guy who pops up in your brain and says, oh, I haven't spread a fragrance and Leggy said I've got to... Right, I want to be that annoying voice in your head that says spray a good fragrance before you leave the house. In fact, pop it in your bag so you can top up at lunchtime. Good night. Actually, it's not good night. It's good day to you and goodbye.